With the ongoing trade war between the U.S. and China, Taiwanese companies are investing more in the U.S. Last year, local corporations invested nearly nine times more in the U.S. than in China. Profits from U.S. investments were also much greater than those from investments in China. One analyst said China's economic performance is unlikely to bounce back in the short term, despite China ending the lockdown it implemented during COVID. Companies listed on TIEX with subsidiaries in China last year earned a combined 503.7 billion NT in profits. That represents a 37 percent growth compared with 2018. In comparison, those with investments in the U.S. last year earned a combined 1.25 trillion NT. That's 554.7 billion NT more than they earned in 2018, representing a growth of 124 percent. China was in lockdown last year, so it was impossible to conduct business normally. And for those with investments in other places overseas, the demand for Taiwan-made electronic components was still very strong. Taiwanese companies' investments in China last year grew by 6 percent, while investments in the U.S. grew by 54 percent. Passive components manufacturer Yageo led the way last year, investing 81.37 billion NT in the U.S., while tech giant TSMC came in second, with investments totaling 55.8 billion NT. Two other big investors were Dachen Stainless Pipe Company, with an investment of 42.26 billion NT, and Far Eastern New Century Corp., which invested 36.64 billion NT. Although China has ended lockdown, it is still in the throes of economic recovery. At present, it seems that there is no obvious incentive to invest in China unless economic activity in the second quarter can return to what Xi Jinping aims for. The researcher expressed doubts that short-term economic performance in China could revert to what it was before the U.S.-China trade conflict began.